Hey guys, it's Paul here. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to promote JVSU products. And uh, if you want to skip this video tutorial, you can do so. And what I'll do is I'll put the links in the description of this video. So you can check out the different strategies that I use when I'm promoting my JVSU offers. Now, if you're new to JVSU, uh, JVSU is basically a marketplace for uh, most of the time the sellers in JVSU are uh, software creators and our part is uh, we are the affiliates and we will be promoting the JVSU products okay so the first thing that you want to do is uh, go to the description of this video and click on the link right and that link is the sign up page and it will take you to this page right so this is the JVSU sign up page so the first thing you do or the first thing that you need to do is register for the account okay so you put your first or full name a valid email address and then your password and then whatever country you are located pretty straightforward now <clears throat> this part right here this is important you need to put a phone number okay so because part of the verification process is they need to be able to speak to you okay to confirm that you are a real person okay so okay so put your phone number in here okay and then click on these two boxes and then click register now once you do that you will be receiving an email and then uh, follow through the steps and you will get the login details okay so now once you receive the email from JVSU, you will be given the link to log in to your JVSU account. Okay, and it looks like this. So in here you will put your email and then the password that you uh, that you use when you created your account and then simply click log in. Okay, so this is the main dashboard of JVSU. So most affiliates who are new to JVSU tend to uh, to be confused in terms of how do you uh, go inside JVSU, where do you go, or how do you use it. Okay, so it's pretty straightforward. So this is your main dashboard, and there are two parts inside JVSU. So the left part here, okay, it is for the sellers. So we are not sellers, we are affiliates. So don't worry about the left part the part that you want to uh, have a look at is this part right here that the right part so here you will see today's affiliate snapshot and this is yesterday's affiliate snapshot so what this means is if you let's say start promoting your affiliate links or your jvc affiliate links once you start getting the sales you will see the numbers right here okay so that's the number of clicks and the number of visitors so the reason why it's different is people might click on that but the visitors is the unique visitors meaning some of the people have clicked on the link but it is the same visitor okay so that's a unique visitor and then it's the number of sales and that's the gross revenue and depending on the commissions that the seller is paying uh, the earnings this is your actual earnings this is gonna be the actual earnings right here okay so that's pretty pretty simple now once you go inside the uh, JVSU account the very important thing that you need to do is go to the my account okay so you need to set up your account first to make sure that uh, they will pay your commissions okay so this is the my account page inside JVSU so very important you need to put your full name and then your login details and also you need to put your PayPal account right and the mailing address phone number and basically you need to set that one up and the reason why it's important to set this up is most of the sellers inside JVSU is they pay the commissions using PayPal Okay, so if you have your PayPal account right here in this uh, section, so what that means is if someone purchased through your affiliate link, then you will be paid via PayPal.
okay cool now let's go to uh, how to the next part is how to select products right so to navigate inside JVSU uh, this is where you will see the uh, different products or approved products but since you are brand new okay I'm assuming that you are brand new in JVSU so the way to do this is if you go to the uh, product library and then you can go to top sellers or featured products so if I go to top sellers cool so here <clears throat> you will see the top sellers for today all right so what this means is that these are the products okay these are the different products that are uh, being promoted by the affiliates and these are the products that are selling and uh, that are making a lot of sales if that makes sense okay so these are all the different products right here and the top sellers yesterday and then you can scroll down top sellers past seven days okay and then uh, top sellers past 30 days so these are all different products now if you want to check right this is important if you want to check let's say you want to start promoting and you don't know where to start right so the way to do this is let's say for example the top sellers today you can go and click this link or see this part that says affiliate details so you can click on the affiliate details and it will take you to this uh, to this page right here so this is the uh, the affiliate request page so what this means is you need to request a permission from this person right so that's the vendor remember we are an affiliate right so this is the vendor so you need to request the permission to promote this uh, product now before you even do or before you even request the permission the way I personally do this is I go to the sales page okay so I check the sales page and I normally would go and uh, let's just pause this one so I would normally go and check the page and find some information on what the product is all about so I normally just read this and then go through the page or watch the video all right and uh, basically just get some information on what this product is all about so what this means is I want to more I want to know more about what is it all about before I even promote okay because you cannot promote something if you don't know wh what is it all about right so pretty straightforward right there now let's say for example if I want to promote this okay and uh, the way you do this is you, oh sorry you can also check out the uh, normally they would put a uh, an affiliate page so I think this is the affiliate page so if I copy and paste this so we can uh, we can see the uh, affiliate page okay so this is the affiliate page so in the affiliate page because uh, you want to know more about the product right so you can check out what's uh, what's this product all about normally they would explain uh, what is it all about or they will even show you the sneak peek you see sneak peek sneak preview of the product so you can have an idea of what this product is all about right so you can then uh, use that in your promotion okay so that's an example of the JV or affiliate page okay now let's say for example that I want to promote this product right so the way I do this or the way you will do this is uh, you click you go here in this box right uh, oh sorry before you do that so the sale price this is the sale price of the product and the commission is 65% so if you do the math 65% of this price if someone purchased through your link you will get paid 65% okay so that's pretty easy okay now the way to apply and request permission to promote this is you go to this area this box and then uh, the way I personally do this and you can copy this okay 
don't just put I want to promote this whatever there there should be a follow the script that I will give you and it's guaranteed that or at least guaranteed that they will approve your request because some of the uh, vendors when you are just uh, starting out with JVSU normally if you are if you don't have any previous sales or any history they will not approve you okay I think the minimum sales for some vendors is 25 sales some of them is at least 50 sales but since you're just starting out uh, this is the tip that I can give you okay so what you can do is put in this box okay so let's just put uh, whatever the name of the vendor is okay so you can just say hi Bayou I would like to promote this product to my email list okay so that's one tip that I can give you okay even if you're just starting out just use this script so tell the vendor okay you would like to promote the product to your email list okay and then the other tip that I can give you is that you can say I'm happy to be on delayed commissions all right so what this means is for some vendors they will approve your uh, permission or they will approve your request to promote the product but you won't be paid the commissions instantly via PayPal so what what have what will happen is uh, because they don't know you yet right they they don't know what's your history so they will approve your request but when you let's say for example you promote your links your affiliate links and someone purchase from your affiliate link you will get the commission but it will sit there for I think some of the vendors will be paying you around 15 days or 30 days some of them 60 days so the reason why they're doing this is because uh, they don't know what your history is or they don't know the quality of leads that you will send right and they don't want the refunds okay they don't want too many refunds so so that's just a tip so this is how you do it okay and then let's just put my name okay so Paolo okay so thanks and then Paolo and then you click this and then request right request affiliate approval so you click that cool so then you will see that the status will be pending approval so you have to wait for that to be approved and my my, my uh, suggestion is don't get stuck waiting for that to be approved okay uh, go ahead and click on the other right click on the other uh, products right here and go to the affiliate details and then do the same uh, same request to promote the product that I showed you until you get the approval now assuming that you already have uh, the the permission to promote the affiliate product so normally it will be emailed to you or they will JVC will send you an email notification and then what you can do is go to your affiliates all right this section and then go to approve products okay in here this is where you will see all the uh, approved products that you can promote on JVSU okay so let's say for example that uh, let me just uh, select one right here so let's just say for example that this is the product that you uh, applied for and you get approved okay so you can get the links you can get your affiliate link by clicking on this green button that says get links okay so that's one way and this is your affiliate link this is gonna be your affiliate link right here okay and you will see here that it says delayed so meaning if I promote this affiliate link and if I if someone purchase from my affiliate link 
uh, I won't be I won't be paid the commission instantly there is a delay but that's okay okay now the other way to do this is if you click that link of that product okay okay let's go ahead so oh this is a good product right here so see for example this sappable right master membership and this product right here is uh, is a software okay it's a software and the reason why I promoted or applied to promote this is because the sale price is 39 so it's not that expensive okay and it's recurring so recurring means every month the person who purchase through my affiliate link they will be paying a fee to this vendor and each time they pay to this vendor I will also get the affiliate commission every month okay pretty clever right so and that's the uh, commission structure right there now again you can click this link or this button if you want to go and check the uh, the sales page now let's say for example that this is the product that you applied for to promote right and you will see here it says your status and it says get links so if you click that here you will be able to get your affiliate link so this is gonna be the affiliate link that you will use so let's say for example you use this in whatever traffic source if someone clicks on this link right if someone clicks on that link and they will be taken to uh, the the main website of this uh, product see sappable alright so let's just wait for this to load so see here if someone purchase this product using your link then you will get paid a commission okay so pretty straightforward right and the commission is uh, what's this 35% uh, so the commission on the first payment is 50% 50% of that right and then 35 percent on the recurring commission so pretty straightforward right not nothing's hard in this part now the question is uh what else do i need to tell you oh how do you check your sales okay so if you go back to uh overview uh, okay so again this is the snapshot for uh your sales today and this is the sales for from yesterday and this is how you will see your sales right here and if you want to get more details on or the detailed stats on your sales you can click this green button cool all right and then in here you can play around with the dates depending on what date date range you want to check you can click today and then refresh okay and you will see the numbers right there so number of clicks number of visitors the number of sales and total so I don't have any sales today so let me just go to yesterday cool and then let me just filter this and you will see here that yesterday I sold one of the products and it paid out 198 right here so pretty clever right cool stuff you know one sale but 198 dollars so not bad right 198 US dollars and some of the products right here so this one one sale and it paid 88 dollars and 94 so hope you're getting the gist right now you will see or you will notice here there's an outstanding paid commissions okay so these sales right here these are already paid some of these are already paid in my uh, PayPal account now this part that says outstanding paid commissions so if I click see details these are the products that uh, that I have sold but because I'm on a delayed uh, delayed payment method so they haven't paid my commission yet so it's still sitting here 
okay so that's cool that's uh, that's that's fine with me because uh, at least I know that the, the money is there okay so by the time that uh, it is due they will pay it to me via PayPal so pretty much that's uh, how you you use and how you navigate JVSU and uh, how you can get your affiliate links yeah so the next question is how do you actually promote your JVSU affiliate link and there are a couple of different methods that I can share and uh, doing all this method or showing all these methods in one video is not enough so what I'll do is I'll put the links in the description of this video and you can check out the different strategies that I personally use when I'm promoting my uh, JVSU affiliate links okay so whether if it's Facebook YouTube solo ads or whatever I will put the links in the description of this video and then it's up to you to decide which traffic source do you want to use okay so that's the best that I can do and I hope that uh, I hope that you found good value because uh, I took some time to create this video and I do hope that you appreciate uh, me doing this short video for you and I hope that you find success with your JVSU uh, marketing right and uh, I hope that it gave you more clarity on how to actually promote or how to navigate inside JVSU and if you like this video please give it a thumbs up uh, share it with your friends and uh, if you have any questions put your comments below and I'll try to answer you and uh, again I'll put the links in the description of this video so you can learn the different strategies that I use for promoting JVSU products and uh, let me know how you go and I'd like to uh, I'd like to hear your success stories so have a good day and all the best God bless you thank you